You either speak to your ancestors or you don't. It's true to me. Well, it's, it's either real or it's not. It's real to me. Doesn't matter. It's objective, is it or not. Anyway, it's real. No, we're, no, we're going to go um, there. Don't worry about that, man. I, I, I have no problem. How do you because, know someone's your ancestor? Because, because I know. All right, you, do you see them? Yes, in my meditation. What do they look like? Why, why, why does that, what does that have to do with anything? I'll tell you why. They I'll tell, like I'll tell you why. Because I'm new to you. They look like people. Because I'm new to you, what you do to me, or you try to do to me, yeah? But I'm questioning your evidence. You're not questioning my evidence. I don't Bro. mind that. Either a creature exists or it doesn't. No matter what you want to think, no matter what your wins and desires are, it either does or it doesn't. Yeah? If a creature exists, he exists. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Regardless of how you feel about it. Yeah? So if atheists might hate the idea of a baby getting cancer at an early age and whatever, who cares? That doesn't mean a creature doesn't exist. 15 years ago, after intellectual investigation, I come to the conclusion there must be something. There must be some initial cause. Why? When I look at the physics and I look at the cosmology of it, there must be an original cause of everything. So I came to the conclusion there must be some creative force, some first cause, something that originated everything that is here. But then I didn't believe in man-made religion. I was agnostic. So I accepted the idea of a creator, but I did not believe in religion as such. Further in intellectual investigation, I come to the conclusion that Islam is the only way of life that marries up with that said creator. Okay, so I'm a Muslim today. I wouldn't be a Muslim today if I didn't know that stuff, right? So what I believe today is not blind. It's based on intellectual investigation. Well, you've made a lot of both saying you're going to wrap up the Muslims and Speakers Corner and that, so I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued. I'm trying to go one by one. Uh, yeah. As long as you establish your point, initially, I don't mind. Because I don't want to just talk in the wind. I want to know what we're talking about. We're going to talk about And what, what you're here to prove. We're going to talk about Alex. So what you're here to prove? I'm here to prove that you don't know what you're talking about. What you're talking about Alex. I don't know what I'm talking about. What have I said about Allah that you don't no, think no, I... Sorry, not you specifically, Muslims. Right. Well, well first thing again, um, I'm me. Yeah, I don't, no one speaks for me and I don't speak for nobody else, yeah? Okay, so, so we'll see. So, 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 so that's the first thing, don't use other conversations you've had with other people as mm. some kind of support for you, yeah? Okay. And say, oh, well, he says that and he's your Muslim brother, so you must believe the same, yeah? I'm my own person, all right? Okay. So if you want to debate... Is Islam unified? So if you, wanna, Islam if, if you want to challenge me, then challenge me in what I've said, yeah? No. You have no. to. No, 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 no. If you're a follower of all Islam, right. Islam is objective, yes? Islam is objective. Okay, and if you're a follower of Islam, and Allah is objective according to a Muslim, yeah? Do you believe a creator is objective or not? No, according to Islam. According to you. According to the Muslims. According to you. No, I'm talking about the Muslims. I'm talking about you. Sorry, it's the debate started yet. It's also, no, not yet. Yeah. This, 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 this is the prelude. This is the prelude, yeah? No, all I'm saying is, is that if you're... Is the idea of a creator objective or not? To the, to the person. To anybody, to anybody. It's true to the people that believe in it. No, is it objective or not? It's true to the people that they believe in it. Is That's it objective or not? You keep using subjective and objective. It's true to the people is that it objective? It. It's true to the people that believe in it. Is it objective or not? It's true to the people that believe in it. No, is it objective though? To who? Okay, do you understand what subjective means? Yes. What? This is a few subjective is when you can look at, when two people can look at the same thing and come to different conclusions. No. So, where do you get your understanding of the word subjective from? Hang on. Because I think, personally... That, so that's not subjective, is it? No. Because I think, personally, All right, you, you don't know the words you use. Personally. If All right. Possible. Because I've seen you use words, 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 and they don't seem to clarify... Sorry, marry up with what you're saying. Okay, so tell me what subjective means. You told me I don't know it. You right. Know what it means. So, so, you, tell so you tell me again what you think it means? I just told you. Go on. Subjective is when, you, when two people, an object, can be looked at as subjective, i.e. a woman's beauty. Right? If I say... No, just, just the general word subjective. No, 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 no. I'm gonna, I'm giving I don't need an example of subjectivity. I'm giving, I'm giving you another example of subjectivity. I don't need that. Well, I just want you to tell me what it means. I'm, I'm the word means first before you I'm utilize it. I'll show you what it means. All right, go on then. If, a woman, if I say a woman's beautiful, yes. and another woman, guy says a woman's ugly, yeah. the be beauty is her beauty would be subjective, not objective. Right, so what does subjective mean? I just, I just showed you. No, definition, word, dictionary definition. Subjective is when you can view something Two different ways, or more than one, more than two different ways. Okay. The subjective is to believe in something based on wins and desire and feelings and emotion rather than facts. That's what subjective means. Right. Is that the definition? Yes. So did I not just give you that example? No. So the woman. No, no, you didn't. No, so no. No, 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 no. You didn't. You didn't. You didn't. I asked you what. No, no, no. I asked you what subjective means. You didn't tell me what subjective means. I just told you it's based on. Um, whims, desire, feelings, right. So I said, so you asked me about Allah, and is it subjective, yeah? And I asked you, do you believe, in, do you believe, the, the, sorry, do you accept that believing in the existence of a creator is objective or subjective? No, I... No, what do you believe? Hang on. Believing in the, the existence of a creator is purely down to the human being. No. 
subject is it objective or subjective? It's subjective to the human being. Why is it subjective? Either, either a creature exists or it doesn't. Because some people, you ready? I'm ready. So hold on. Let's. let's Are we rolling? Yeah, just just roll, let's man. Just roll. Let's let's roll. What's the discussion about? Uh, it's about Allah at the moment. Well, no, I don't know what the discussion is about right now. Let's about pinpoint Allah. it. He said it's about Allah. Um, and my his point is he's going to prove today that what? Like, like I said to you, the point I'm going to today is if you look at Allah object. No, no, no. What are you going to prove? What's your point? I'm going. Okay. The point that I'm saying is if Allah is looked at objectively by Muslims and not the rest of the world, I can show why when you talk to someone that's not of a Muslim school of thought, why, why you're not making sense. Okay. What's the point you're going to prove? That when you talk about Allah to someone who doesn't believe in Allah, why you don't make sense. I need you to understand. Right, right, right. So just, just clarify, okay. mm. clarify. You're going to prove today that when I speak to people about my subjective beliefs and no, perception... It's not, of... it's not about proving something. I'm going to explain, I'm going to show well, you... You're going to show me what does that mean? Show me what? I'm going to... Let me explain. Well, show me I'm then. I'm going to show you why when you speak to people right. who don't believe in Allah, right. why you're not making any sense. Right. So if I speak to you about Islam, mm. I'm not making sense. That's what you're going to prove. I just said Allah. Did I say Allah or did I say Islam? Well, Allah is from Islam. Well, I'm talking oh, about Allah. You're talking about Allah specifically. Okay, okay. So, so my su subjective perception of Allah, of the Creator that exists objectively, yeah? Hang on, you have a subjective view of Allah. Perception, of course, is subjective. So the view of Allah is not objective? No, I didn't say that, did I? What did I say to you initially? I said to you, Explain yourself. is the belief in a creator or the fact that a creator exists or not objective or subjective? To the person? No. It's true to the no. person who believes in it? No, you're wrong. Because either a creator exists or it doesn't. No matter what you want to think, no matter what your wins and desires are, it either does or it doesn't. Yeah? If a creator exists, he exists. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Regardless of how you feel about it. Yeah? So if atheists might hate the idea of a baby getting cancer at an early age and whatever, who cares? That doesn't mean a creator doesn't exist. Right? So the idea of a creator existing is objective. Yeah? Now, believing in what that creator is, Zeus, Allah, whatever, that is subjective. But subjective beliefs can be based on facts as well. Yeah? So, again, remind me of your point. I just told you the point. No, you, you went... All right, so... Just, I just jump to repeat it. Yes. Without you speaking, though. Yes. Because you keep jumping in. Go on, then. Okay. I am here to show you that when you are speaking about Allah to someone who doesn't believe in Allah, why you don't make any sense. That's what I'm going to do today. So... <laughs> Is that, okay, I'll, no, no, I'll, 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 I'll go deeper. Yeah, go deeper. I've had many conversations. Oh, with, forget the conversations. I'm, 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 I'm going deeper. I don't need you to go that deep. I'm going deeper to make you understand what I'm saying. I think you'll go deeper in the conversation. Okay, Let's just stay on uh, okay, point. Okay, okay. So you're saying to me... Uh, okay. I've had many conversations with many Muslims and they say, Sarah, we don't understand what you're saying. We don't understand what you're, what you're talking about. And I'm saying to you, the re I'm going to show you why you don't understand. Are you talking to the straw man here now? Are we going to converse or...? Well, no, because look, look. You want to talk, look, do logic? Let's do logic, yeah? Because I know, I remember very clearly on the YouTube channel, you challenged me. You said you're going to call me out. You're going to wrap up the Muslim Zero Speakers Corner. Here I am. All right, okay. And the way you're going to do it, and the way you're going to do it is using logic. Okay, so the first logical fallacy you've been using since we started is the straw man fallacy, yeah? Which is uh, creating an argument that I am. Okay, straw man is when you build up an argument. No, no, no I'm saying what's my straw? Yeah, okay. Oh yeah, your challenge. You're saying when Muslims speak about Allah, they yeah. don't know what they're talking about, right. yeah? And you just said you're proving to me I don't uh, know what I'm talking about. When you speak to someone else. When I. When me personally. Muslims in general. No, me personally. Muslims in general. Right. So right. So change your point. That's not your point, then, is it? Your point is Muslims don't know what they're talking about. Not me. Okay, but you're a Muslim, though. Right. So then, wouldn't you be? Do all Muslims believe the same? Okay, fine. Let me Talk the same. Okay. Right. Okay. I have to establish this point, Sarah, because okay, you go in the wind, man. Is the point now? Yeah. So, so I'll clarify it again. It's clear, bro, this has to be done so we know what you're okay, talking about. Right, and at the end we can see whether you did what you claim you were going to okay, do. Go Rappers, Muslims out. Go on, go on. And then I'll show you my claim. All right? So we're going to do two claims here. You, you, we'll, we'll wrap your claim up. You can go for it, mate. Alhamdulillah. So you're, you're going to today, in front of all these people here and all the people watching on camera, mm. prove with empirical evidence that when a Muslim speaks to somebody about Allah, mm. they don't know what they're talking about. Right. Okay. Fair enough. Go for it. Okay. So, it's an exercise that everyone else can join in, right? Anyone, anyone else can join in. It's called the sense train. A uh, question, sorry. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. One second, one second, one second, one second, one second. One second. Oh. Um, this is a, um, sorry, a, a, a request to all of the brothers. Please don't join in, because you just use you. Carry on. Okay. I never request. 
you want us to be moderated in terms of time? No. no it's, fine, it's fine, it's fine. Let it roll, mate. Okay, so I'm going to say a, a series of statements and you will tell me if they make sense. Yeah? So I'm going to say to you, a monkey with the genetic code of a monkey. Speak louder. Oh, a monkey with the genetic code of a monkey gives birth to or creates, brings forth a chair. Does that make sense to you? No. Okay. If a fish with the genetic code of a fish brings forth, creates, gives birth to a monkey, does that make sense to you? No. If a monkey with the genetic code of a monkey brings forth, creates, gives birth to another monkey, does that make sense to you? Yes. Why did that make sense to you? Because the genetics of a monkey is to give birth to monkeys, not chairs. Okay. So when, so you understood exactly why it made sense and so did I. I'm in total agreement with you, yeah? Okay. When people, I've spoken to many Muslims and they've said to me, they've said to me, Allah, that created everything, gave birth to everything, created everything, is nothing like the thing in which it created and the thing that it created is nothing like it. Would that be correct? So you're saying that Allah creates and whatever, it, so basically Allah says, according to Muslims and according to what they believe, according to the Quran, what it says, that nothing in creation can be compared with creator, yeah? Yes, I agree. So you agree that Allah, with his genetic code, what, when he, whoa, 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 what do you mean genetic code? In, in, in quotation. What, what did it say to you? In quotation. What did it say to you? What do you mean? Nothing in creation can be compared to Allah, so forget genetics, mate. Hang on. Hang on, but we have to use what we know as human beings. Yeah, but we can't. No, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. This is why I say, yeah, but Sarah, Sarah. I'm not finished, I'm not finished. I'm not, let me finish, finish. If you're going to speak about something, like I said to someone, yeah, we are going to have to speak within the realms of what we know makes sense. Alhamdulillah. Not of what we believe, okay. what we okay. know makes okay. sense. Hang on, hang on. We know it makes sense for something, when it creates something else, to be of the same something. That's what we know. Yes? You say, Allah being a, another something, when it creates something, it is nothing like the thing that it creates, and the thing that it creates is nothing like it. Does that make sense? I just said yes. Speak okay. louder. Like I said to you, in the realms of what we know as human beings, Okay, stop, 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 stop. stop. No, no, I have, to stop, no, I have to stop you. I have to stop you. Stop you. You, you were trying to play in the paradigm of Muslims and what they believe. Okay. Now I told you the Quran is clear. The create no. You're not, you're, you're, Who defines you're, sense? You're not, you're not getting it. I am getting it. You're not getting I'm it. exactly getting you're it. You're not getting it. I'm getting on point, mate. What do we know makes sense? Oh, uh, okay. Look, As human beings. I'll, I'll say it again to you. Allah. You're talking about my paradigm here, mate. You're talking about my belief here, mate. You're trying that's, to that's right, 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 that's so what, let's, that's right, what right, I'm right, 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 right. So, so, so let's go with the, right over what we know. Right, right. You're not going to. No, make but the sense. problem, the problem is your sense is right, and and your sense is defined by what? What the creator tells me. What, no, what you believe. No. Yes. No. What you believe. No. What believe mean? There's a difference. What believe mean? Okay, then. So let's go back again. Let's go back again. What's believe me? No, let's go back again. No. And I, no, hang on, let's go because I need to, I need to hammer this home. Hammer what home? I need to hammer it home. When I'm speaking, you are working at what I teach, what I believe, on, yeah. Hang on, hang are you on. working from hang that though? Hang on. You are working on that premise, I yeah. I said to you, I said to you. Go on. We have to work as human beings. Right. When we're speaking to other human beings. Right. About what we know makes sense as human beings. We know something with the genetic code of itself brings forth and creates something else of the of same, same gender. Right. That's what we know. Right. We don't know anything about something that's not of a, that's got its own thing that brings forth something that's nothing like it. We don't know anything like that, do we? Except the creator. Carry on. No, that's a, uh, uh, is that a knowing or a belief? What? Is that a knowing or a belief? What do you mean? What do you mean by belief? You don't know. Define the word belief. Listen. You're going to make pay work games, it's fine. But it's no, 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 Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. I'm going to make sure you understand your questions. It's fine. So define belief. So when you talk about Allah, do you have a belief in Allah or a knowing that Allah is? What do you mean by belief? I'll, 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 give, you I'll give you another. I'll give you another example. Just define the word you're using. I'll give you another example. Just define the word you're using. Just define the word you're using. Another example. No, just use that example. No, no, you Why you want to another example? I'll give you another example. Just define belief. I'll give you another example. Just define belief. I believe. Can't you define the word belief? I, Using the word belief again. No, I want you to define the word belief. I can fly. Now, that's what I'm using. I believe, I, hang on, I believe I can fly. Now, what I do is I go to the top of the building with that belief and I jump off the building and I go and I break both my legs. Right. Now I know I can't fly. I don't have to, I don't, there's no belief. What does I belief mean? Fly anymore. What does belief mean? Anymore. What does belief mean? A belief, a belief 
leaves room. Why is belief me? Hang on, hang on. A belief leaves room for doubt. In the knowing, there's no more. What room does for belief doubt. mean? I'm you're not explaining. You're not. You're not. I'm explaining you're not thing. explaining okay, it. I'll tell you what we do. Let's just. I'll go. give you. I'll give an example. Let's just go to the no. definition. No, no, no. Because how just do you? No, 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 no. Definition. All right. Let's just go to the definition. Yeah. I'll tell you what. Yeah, yeah, that'd be good. That'd be easier, right? Fantastic. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Belief. Definition. Here we go. An acceptance of something exists or is true, especially one without proof. Right. Without proof. Now, right. when I was on top of that building, right. I believed I could fly. Right. Right. And then I jumped off and I now have proof that I can't fly. Okay. So I now know I can't fly. Right. Do you have a belief in Allah or a knowing in Allah? No, 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 no. Um, I accept the existence of Allah. <laughs> like I just said to you, do you believe in Allah or I, do you oh, know okay. Allah? Okay, I'll make it easy for you. I accept the existence of Allah. With so is it a belief or is it annoying? It's an acceptance. Ah, you want to play the word game now? No. Okay, I see you. No, You're see playing you. the word game, no, not no, me. You You're no, trying to tie no, me into no, words no, that you no, want no, to because, create your paradise. Earlier on in this conversation, you said I believe. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, no didn't. not at all. Okay. Check the cameras, I didn't say so, that. Okay, so you accept Allah? I accept the existence of a creator, yes. Okay, so you, so you never use the word belief when you talk to people? No. So don't say, I believe, and I believe, and I believe, and I believe. What did I just say right at the very beginning? Please don't use other conversations you've had with Muslims. I'm, I'm asking you, I'm asking you as a person. You don't use the word belief? No. I don't know if I believe you. But <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. If you I, don't, want, I don't have proof. So well, I know it's a well if, you want, if you want to accept no, that, I actually know it's a belief. Know, if you want to accept that, just I watch. Know it's a belief. Okay. If you want to accept that, and everyone else can do this, go to EF Tower, check out my videos, and see what I say. Okay. So you accept the existence, the existence of a creator. Of a racer. Yeah. So it's not a belief, and it's not a knowing. But it can't be a belief because I don't believe without reason. Okay. So let's. Or without proof. So as soon as we went to dictionary definition, let's look up. I know that. Okay. Let's look it up. Let's look it up. See what it means, right? Yeah. Fine. Okay. It was always going to be a long one. You seem like you're scared to be wrong about anything. Scared? Yeah, you seem like you're fearful of being wrong about anything when you have your debates. Really? So you yeah. come across, yeah. <laughs> Why do you say that? Because Actually, you know what? I'm not going to go for that. Forget that. I'm not going to bite there. Relax. Yeah, Relax, mate. Acceptance. The action of one second, one second. For the purpose of the camera, this guy here will have a debate about what you just said, yeah? I don't need to debate. No, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'll tell you why, yeah? Because chirps in from the background is one thing. Backing up what you say. Yeah, but I'm not going to get deflect right now. Okay, carry on. Okay, so acceptance. acceptance. Uh, the action of consenting to receive or undertake something offered. Okay, so basically you're offered Allah. Sorry? Basically uh, can you read Allah. the rest of the definitions I accept? The action of consenting to receive or undertake something offered. Right, and, and what's the Changes involving the acceptance of bribes, um, receiving... Can you accept an idea? Take you it's true. It. Yeah, can you accept an idea is true. You can accept it. Yeah. So For you example, can, you accept many ideas are true, but you can't no, no, prove no, no, none no, of them. No, 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 no. Yeah. About Allah now, right? No, we're, we're talking about acceptance, here, mate. No, 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 no. Talk so, about acceptance. Okay. So let's play the game. The acceptance of Allah. Then. Acceptance of anything. The acceptance of Allah. No, you just try to define the word so acceptance. You've accepted Allah. I've accepted. Okay, I see where you're going. I've accepted. So you're trying to get out. There's no getting out. I'm, I'm nothing. I'm, I'm going to call you. So you're trying to get out, but I'm going to call you. No getting out of nothing, mate. I'm going to call you. Don't worry. Yeah. Okay. So you've accepted Allah. I've accepted the existence of a creator. Yes. Okay. So what does the word acceptance means? You've been given it, basically. You've received it. No. No, no, and you've accepted no, it. I've had reason to accept the idea, yes. Okay, but I could re have reason to accept the food because I'm hungry, whatever. I, I, still, yeah. I still accepted uh, the I have food. the lab. So I've food. had the, okay, okay make it easy for you. I've accepted. He doesn't ever want to say I've accepted. I don't, but could you know what? I'm right here. I'm not in the background. All right, all right. Belief means accepting the existence of something without knowledge, yeah? No, with no proof. No, without evidence. Or evidence, or evidence, or evidence. Okay. So belief is one thing. I don't believe in God because with no evidence. Not at all. I accept the existence of a creator due to evidence due to evidence yes okay so have we have we yet established right that when you're talking about Allah the acceptance of Allah the acceptance of a creator yes right when you talk to someone who doesn't who who hasn't accepted it let's say like myself why you don't make sense do you understand why you, if you were to speak okay. to me about Allah if I speak to you about Allah if you speak to me about Allah yeah why you wouldn't make sense to me do you, want, do you understand why you wouldn't make sense no I don't so I'll explain again, like we'll go back to the beginning. Because you say that this thing, this idea, remember, your acceptance of an idea, huh? remember? An idea is what? Is idea concrete? Is idea proof? Well, we look at the evidence, isn't it? Is idea uh, annoying? We'll look at the evidence, it's isn't it? Idea. Look at the evidence. It's not an idea based on nothing, is it? It's, it's supported by evidence. Okay, so you've got an idea and you accept the idea. No, no, so I don't accept the idea. I accept the evidence for that idea. 
So if you want to challenge the evidence okay, for the okay, idea, so, I don't mind. So, so just let me understand. You accept the evidence for the idea. Right. I'll give you an example. I'll make it easy for you. No, yeah, I'll, make I'll, it easy for me. I'll make it easy for everybody here. Make it easy for me. I'll make everybody here, make yeah? Me. Let's say 16 years ago, yeah, I was an atheist. I didn't believe in a creator. I didn't believe in man-made religion. Nothing like that. Okay. 15 years ago, after intellectual investigation, I come to the conclusion there must be something. There must be some initial cause. Why? When I look at the physics and I look at the cosmology of it, there must be an original cause of everything. So I came to the conclusion there must be some creative force, some first cause, something that originated everything that is here. But then I didn't believe in man-made religion, I was agnostic. So I accepted the idea of a creator, but I did not believe in religion as such. Further in intellectual investigation, I come to the conclusion that Islam is the only way of life that marries up with that said creator. Okay, so I'm a Muslim today. I wouldn't be a Muslim today if I didn't know that stuff, right? So what I believe today is not blind, it's based on intellectual investigation. Okay, so if, right? I, if I said to you the Christians also intellectually investigated Christianity and came to the exact same conclusion that there was some kind of creator, you, what, you would say what to the Christian? Uh, if the Christian come to me and said, I, I would, first of all, I would define that creator. Now, any Christian here today who worth his salt will, will define a creator as the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, three in one. They'll, they'll go to the next level. No, Jehovah's Witnesses wouldn't. What? They believe Jesus became God on earth. Yeah, but they say the Father is one. They, and according to Christianity, they're not Christians. They'll be burned at the stake for their heresy. Well, that's according to them, so it becomes... Right, the, right, 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 right. Right, right. 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 So, so, no, no, no. Like you just said, look. Whether a creator exists or not is objective. Either a creator does exist or a creator doesn't exist. There's no in between. It does okay. or it doesn't. Okay. So okay. So right. 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 Those so the only, I. I those are the only two options. So I came to those the. Those are the only two options. I came to the intellectual understanding. Yes, I believe so. That so a creator if exists. Are, if, those, if those are the only two options. Yes, that's what I believe. <laughs> except. Ah, <laughs> you use the word believe. Great. Uh, Freudian slip. Fantastic. 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 That's what I accept. So, okay. So you the, fully the, buried him. The, the, the thing is. Yeah, buried. Fully buried. No, no, yes. No, no, the thing is, Pigeon right, chest, mate. Pigeon no, chest. No, but the thing is, right? The reason why I said to you I don't believe that you don't use the word believe because I because I just I love the slip up that you just made because I actually know in it's your semantics no, mate no, 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 I know that in your day-to-day -day conversations you, you you do use the word believe. you don't but how do you know that because how do you know that do you see my day-to-day conversations sorry I believe it do you see my day-to-day -day conversations believe I don't have any proof believe that knowledge proof that you just so why you say so you don't <laughs> um, I do have proof you so you, you have no proof yet you believe it oh fair enough no, I have so you believe in stuff without proof fair enough carry on you use the word believe no you believe in stuff without proof I like the slip I don't so what I'm trying to say is if those are the only two options that you had Right, that uh, a creator either exists or doesn't exist. Oh, okay, let me make it easier for you. The universe as it exists today is accidental or deliberate. No, no, no. I'm Same saying, thing. No, no, I'm saying Same you. principle. If you have it either exists or doesn't exist, which one is it? For me, exists. Okay, so it's six for you, and then for someone else, it won't. It be no, it doesn't. Yeah, but the idea of look, look, you are right. right. Either exists or doesn't exist. That is objective. That is what objective. Okay, so then when we get into the realms of whether or what, not it, what it is what, is different. Ah, uh, then it becomes subjective. Unless you bring evidence to support it, then it becomes objective again. Okay, okay. So are you telling me that you've got evidence to, to yes, support? Yes, of course it? I have. Okay, so if you say you have evidence to support it, and you say Allah is a fact to you, yeah. Yes. Okay. If I was to ask you again, I'll use this um, all the time. If I said to you one plus one is what, you would say two. Okay, and that is a fact or is it a belief? Well, according to the laws of mathematics, it's a fact. Okay, so if I was to say to everyone here, does Allah exist? What, 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 what conclusion will be? Ask the question, does a creator exist? Okay. What does some will say yes, some will say no, some will say don't know. Okay. So, so that's objective. So, okay, so we know what's objective. One plus one being two is objective. No, I don't see anyone arguing one plus one isn't two. Right. Right, but people will argue whether Allah is the creator, whether... No, but, no, 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 creator, but, no, 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 no. Whether, hang on, whether Brahmin's a creator. No, 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 no. no so no, is that no, now... No, 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 Now you've gone to perception. Now you've gone to perception. We're talking oh, okay. about a creator. We're talking about a first cause. Either a first cause that caused everything exists, or it didn't, and it all accident happened by accident. Okay, so say, oh, say everyone agreed in the first cause. Imagine that. Everyone agrees right. the first cause, right? right? But everyone agrees, or people differ in their agree of the first cause. Right. For instance, you say the, the term Allah, he's right. the term Brahmin, and he's right. the term then we would Yahweh. All right, okay. Then we would investigate what, why they believe that. Okay, so we investigate why they believe it. Yeah. Say, 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 imagine I say to you, I've been the investigator and I've investigated why people believe it. I would question why you've investigated. I've investigated why everyone's you, story. Why have you not questioned my evidence? Because to, to me, if everyone to me, if everyone's coming to the same conclusion, i.e. there's a creator, because you can go all around the globe and then no, no, come no. to that conclusion. You can ask this question to as many people like around the globe. Does right. a creator exist? Right. Yes, no, don't know. Three answers. Nothing right. more, nothing less. That's an objective question. 
Right. Now, once you accept that a creator exists, and then you want to go into the realms of Brahman, Zeus, Allah, whatever, 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 uh -huh, uh -huh. that's subjectivity. But that's subject. Oh, 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 okay, wait, 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 right. But, but, okay, but, go on, go on. but that subjectivity can also be challenged. So a subjective thing is not defined, definite. For example, a child. Is not so first thing. Uh, what did I just say? No, you said a you subjective into, belief. Hang on, you said when you go into no, no, the no. realms of Brahmin, Allah, what did I say? And Jesus. All right, let me say, shall subjective. I say what I said? Because I said it. Okay, you go. All right, thank go, you. Go, 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 go. Appreciate that. Thank you. Let me speak my own words. Yeah, you okay, do. okay. So, what I said to you is this: the realms of subjectivity are not bound into subjectivity. For example, my daughter might believe there's a monster under her bed because she watched some cartoon on TV, and in that cartoon there was a monster under her bed. Mm -hmm. She subjective believes now there's a monster. She goes to bed at night, she thinks that monster's there. Now, she could say to me, Dad, there's a monster in my bed. I say, there's no monster under your bed. Until I get the torch out, lift up the mattress, show her, look, there's nothing there. Right. Right. Just like me jumping off the bed. Right, right, the right, right. So now, so her, right, so now, so her subjective belief it will change. Right, to a now, knowing. So, right, no, no, to an objective belief. Because there either is a monster or not. No, to a knowing. But she knows there's no, no, she, it's she knows there's no, no, no. monster under her bed. Her subjectivity has now been removed. And she now so knows. So subjectivity, so for example, someone wants to believe in Zeus and such and such. Right. There has to be a reason why they believe that. Right. Like my daughter believed in the monster in the bed because of the cartoon she watched. Right. Why do people believe Zeus and Brahman and, and such and such a thing? And Allah. That needs to be questioned. Right. Question Allah. Alhamdulillah. Right. 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 But you cannot tell me what I believe about Islam is wrong. Did I say that? Well, what was the point in your original? No, but did I say that? What was your original I point? I said when you're speaking about Allah. Right. To someone who doesn't. Accept, believe, understand Allah. Right. You are not making sense. And I tell you okay. why. If this is true, if this is true, Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. Hang on. Sarah, 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 Sarah. Hang on. I'm going to prove you wrong. You why you're not I'm going to prove you wrong for the benefit of the camera. I've spoken <sighs> to 170 people who've embraced Islam, mm. who didn't know about Islam, who didn't know about Allah. After they were spoken to, mm. they accepted it. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Yeah? Okay. So it does make sense to some people. Maybe not you. I'm not saying it doesn't. It makes no, sense to 1.6 billion people. We're right? talking about people who don't know, you said. Okay, well, it. How, what's the rest of the global you, population? You said people who no, don't what's know. The rest of the global population? Well, what if 1.6 billion, maybe uh, 3.4, 3.45. Okay. Okay, so we've got 3.45 people that don't believe. So you're telling me tomorrow, if you got on TV with everyone speaking, or you could speak and everyone sat down in front of the TV and you told them about Allah, every, all those other people would accept it? No. First thing you have to do, in my honest, uh, right. what, okay. I, what I um, do. Because you're taking 170 people like it was some kind of, you know, pat on the back. I'm no, saying I'm saying, no, 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 no. Okay, you made on. a statement, does speaking to people who don't, don't, know, don't know about Allah make sense to them? And it must must do because they accept Islam because I speak to them about it. Okay. So you're wrong. Okay. So you have some. It's fine. You have some. Oh, no, no, no. Not fine. You have some. No, no, no. How? You have some. No, are you fine. saying? Let me let me go back to your original point. Are you saying it makes sense to nobody? No. Or some people it don't make sense to. You don't. You don't make sense to a lot of people. Not just some. A lot of people. What the idea that a creator exists? No. That no no. I told you. I told you the parameters. The idea that you can get something that can create something else. All right. That is not of its own quote unquote genetic code, using in quotations, and that not be of the same something. Unle we, uh, unless I, 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 okay. we know, right? Within our realm of right. knowing, we all know monkeys don't create chairs and fish don't create monkeys. Right. Right. We know that. That's what we know as human beings. Right. We don't know about something so? that can create something that is not like the same okay. something. Let's go back to logic. We don't know that. Let's go back to logic. That, no, but we don't, go, let's no, go back to logic. Do we know that? Sarah, you want to talk logic? No, but do we know that? Do you want to talk that? logic or you want to talk whims? Do we know that? Do you want to talk logic? Or do we believe that? Oh, okay. You do know the law. Hamza, Ham okay. Hamza, I'm, I'm, I'm actually asking a question. Do you know the I'm logical actually, fallacy I'm, about I'm, evidence I'm, of absence I'm, and not absence I'm, of evidence? You, you know that? Hamza. Are you aware of that? Hamza. Are you aware of that logical fallacy? Yes. Because you, you're Hamza. employing but it. I'm asking you a question though. I know you are, but you're employing no, I'm it. I'm asking you a question. What's your question? The question is, we know what makes sense in our right. realm of what makes right. sense as human beings. We right. know that right. right. we don't know. Right. Sorry, we know something that has the same genetic code as itself right. brings forth the right. same thing. Right. Do we know of anything, do we know of anything else that does not do that, that has its own thing? Who's we? Human beings. Do we know? Yeah, yes, we do. No, we don't. Yes, we, we do. It. No, no, we, no, we don't. We don't. I, just, I just told you I don't believe it because I have evidence. No, you, you didn't use the word believe, you know acceptance, but I don't, no, you're using belief. The reason why you keep using but, belief yeah. is because that's without knowledge. And I don't accept the existence of a creator without knowledge. I don't see why you're not getting that. Like I said to you, does it... Challenge the evidence, mate. No, hang on, listen. listen. You're, not, you're not even getting it. Actually, <laughs> yeah, I'm, getting, I'm getting, getting it, mate. Getting it. I am getting it. Our realm of knowing things is limited to what we know. That That... Our realm of actually knowing something. The, the natural, yes, the natural world. I agree. Beings, the, the natural world. world. The natural world. 
our realm of knowing things knowing the natural world is limited to what we know right okay you are talking about something yep that we don't know about something that we have no idea about something that we you keep saying we know. including me stop including me in your we, we. can't even comprehend any muslims here Listen, any muslims here muslims. are you guys included in this we I've no. spoken. we're not okay. we're not i'll ask you a question we're not no 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 don't respond don't respond I, I, no, you said don't yes. respond, no, you said yes. don't respond. Do you know what allah is can you comprehend it? Yeah. You can comprehend it. Don't get, don't fall for it. <laughs> you can comprehend. He's trying Allah. to slip it. He's trying to slip it. Don't okay. let him slip it. Can you comprehend Allah? Can I? I can only comprehend of Allah what He's disclosed of Himself. No. I, I, that, can you comprehend Allah? Of I, what Allah is. I can only comprehend of what He's disclosed of Himself. So if He says, if so Allah, there are things you can comprehend about Him and things you can't. I can listen. Would I not be doing a disservice to Allah if I spoke about things He never told me about? I don't know. Would you? I, I believe you're doing a disservice by speaking about him in the first place, but that's just my belief. What? So, well, I'm doing a disservice speaking to Allah that he's revealed about himself and no, told me to tell people no, about no, him. You, I believe Ex no, explain that, Sarah. I, I you just said I'm doing a disservice to Allah by telling people about the things he's told us about him. Because it's a belief. No. Because it's, no, because it's, it's not. Yes, because it the belief is without knowledge and without evidence, and you, that's where you're wrong. That's where you messed up, mate. Okay. You ain't talking to a Christian, mate. Talk to a Muslim. Okay, you're talking, I'm talking to a Muslim. But like I said to you, if you have the evidence, like I said to you, back to the one plus one is two things, right? Facts, ob ob objective facts, basically become self-evident. Basically, they become. If, uh, so, me asking everyone what one plus one is two is is actually it's, a, it's rhetorical. You, I don't even need to ask you. You already know why? Because it's self. What if you ask somebody who doesn't know maths? On, what if you ask a, a one-year-old baby? Would they answer I'm you? about once you. All right. Well, once you uh, ask a baby, the baby can't even speak. What's five times five? Twenty-five. What if you ask um, an Aborigine who's never even picked up a maths book? What's five times five? We have to well, ask uh, uh, language. Are they going to answer? All right. If you're speaking to him in English. And they haven't learned maths. And they haven't learned maths. So somebody hasn't learned maths, yeah? And what are they going to answer to your question, mate? They don't. They don't know. They, they will also they don't know what they will say. Right, they, right, they right. Know are they going to say 25? No, they'll say I don't know. Right, so it's not obvious then, is it? It's only if you. Oh, yeah? so Allah isn't obvious then. What's that got to do with what you said? No, hang on. So hang on, hang on, hang on. So I'm, look, the question, the statement I'm trying to say is something that is a fact. To me, it become becomes self-evident at a certain age. Let's say one plus one. Unle it's, unless you don't learn maths. Unless you don't learn maths. So are you now saying that because we haven't learnt? Islam, we haven't learnt Allah or what Allah is, that's why the rest of the what three point how many billion people don't know the reason it's their fault because they haven't learned. Okay. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> right. So, 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 so is, it now, is it now for you to bring it to Let me just understand that question. Let me just understand that question. Are you saying Is that what you're saying? Let me just understand that question right, first. On. Did you just ask me? <laughs> those people who are not Muslim, until you teach them about Allah, then they wouldn't know about Allah. Is that what you're saying? I'm saying. I think that's what you just said. It, yeah, you. Ha you I don't get your point. Are, are you now saying that? <laughs> just like we wouldn't, if we didn't teach the person math, they wouldn't know the answer to a math right. question. If you don't talk to people about Allah, of course they won't know about Allah. Okay. So, so, so now let's... they might. Now here's the other thing you see. This is why Allah and the Creator we have to first establish. A creator, uh, an Eskimo might not know about Allah, the Quran, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and all of this, but they might be aware of a, of a Creator that there's something. Yeah. Those are people. Are. Alhamdulillah. So, even without Islam, even without that. They'll know there's something, but that's not defined by Allah. So of course, it's a stupid question, mate. Do people know about Allah if you don't tell them about Allah? No, they don't, mate. What's your point? Okay, so my point is, if, like I said, I will go back. Go back. If everyone has a come to a universal agreement that there's some kind of entity, force, or whatever that created this, you are now going to say it's Allah. They would say it's uh, whatever based, they, on their, it, based, based on their based based on their based social on, conditioning. So then you would say their social conditioning is. One wrong? No. I'd oh. no, 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 it's no. Wrong. I'd question okay. their evidence, mate. Okay. Just as I'm going to question your ancestor evidence, okay. I'm going to question the evidence of these other beliefs. No, it's not. It's objective. You either speak to your ancestors or you don't. Uh, it's true to me. Well, it's, it's either real or it's not. It's real to me. Doesn't matter. It's objective, if it's or not. Anyway, it's real. No, we're, no, we're going to go um, there. Don't worry about that, mate. I, I, I have no problem. Alhamdulillah. I have no problem. So you do speak to your ancestors? Of course. Do they speak to you? Yes. How? Via my meditation. No, how do they speak to you? With words. Well, you hear their voice? Yes. How do you know your ancestors? Because they, because I know them. How do you know them? Because I do. How do you know? Because I know. How do you know it's not a demon speaking to you? I don't know a demon. How do you know it's not a demon? I don't know a demon. <laughs> how, do you, oh, how do you know your ancestors? How do you because, know someone's your ancestor? Because, because I know oh, right, you, Do you see them? Yes. In my meditation. What do they look like? Why, why, why does that, what does that have to do with anything? I'll tell you why. I'll tell, like tell you why. Because I'm doing to you. They look like people. Because I'm doing to you what you do to me. Or you try to do to me, yeah? But 
I'm questioning your evidence. You're not questioning my evidence. I don't Bro, mind that. I'm, I'm questioning your evidence. I'm not, doesn't matter. I'm, I'm doesn't matter. Doesn't, matter. doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I am not here telling everyone uh, that ancestor reverence. What are you here to? What are you here know, telling everybody? On, that, that you speak to your ancestors is the way, the truth, and everyone. No, 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 no. We're interested in that. We want to know whether you're mad or not. I'm saying the truth. No, no, no. We're just going to establish because I've heard you say that you're you conceded. I like to switch the conversation though. Keep going. Switch. Go, go, go. Switch conversation. Go, 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 go. Same topic, mate. Same thread. Same thread, mate. Go, go, go. Okay. I've heard you say, and you can correct me if. If I'm incorrect, yeah. that um, you believe you speak to your ancestors, isn't it? Yes. Right. And that you're crazy for believing for doing that. And you're deluded. Right. Right. Why do you say you're deluded? Because to someone, everyone's deluded. No. What, all right. What does deluded mean? Should we look? Should we get? No, you don't. Do you, oh, no, no, no. Let's get a different we definition. Don't need to. Again. We don't need to. We don't need no, to. We do, we do. No, no, no. We need to know if you know what you're talking about. We do. We do. We do. Do you know what deluded means? Do you know what deluded means? We do. We do. Can you give me the word? Okay. Uh, there it is. But you can challenge it later. Uh, uh, do you know what it means? Calm down. All right. So you don't know what you're talking about again. No, no. All right. Let's get. Let's get. Let's get. Let's get it. Deluded, deluded is believing in something contrary to over sorry in spite of overwhelming uh, evidence to the contrary that's what deluded a is a delusion yes evidence to the contrary no a delusion mm. is believing in something which is contrary to overwhelming evidence against it that's like what delusion is like talking like to your answer like right? no no i didn't say that okay. oh right. sorry sorry that's why i said right. whoa, 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 whoa. hang on that's why i said in the video okay. we're all crazy here we go, here we go, and here we go. i have absolutely no problem in everyone well i'm going to respond what i have a problem is is someone saying that they've got a superior type of crazy over my crazy right. well i'm going to show crazy. i'm going to show no hierarchy in crazy i'm going to show like, there's no hierarchy okay in crazy. okay everyone if you want to okay well, now we're in logic again he's made the claim that i'm deluded okay therefore the burden of proof is on him to show him deluded. Now, to sh for him to show me deluded, he I needs to bring. No, 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 no. He needs to bring overwhelming evidence to the contrary that Allah exists. So, Bismillah, show me. Say, say, say that again. Okay. Sorry, I was... You made the claim, I'm deluded, first thing. Okay. Now, according to the laws of logic, if you make the claim, the burden is on you, the one making the claim. So, for you to support the claim of me being deluded, you must now produce overwhelming evidence to the contrary of my belief or my acceptance of a creator called Allah. No, what you're doing is. Your... Now, produce your evidence. No, what you're doing is... If you can't produce your evidence, Listen, don't make the claim. Listen, All right. you're shifting the burden of proof. I'm not shifting nothing, mate. Yes, you are. Who made the claim? Hang on. I'll explain to you why the claim or why the counterclaim was made. We've gone into this. Why do you guys always do this? What do you mean we've gone into this? I've never spoken to you about this. I've never spoken to you about this, mate. Hang on, hang on, hang on. The claim of Muslims is that Allah exists. Yes or no? Okay. No, he just on, made a claim. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Now he's trying to slip it, yeah? He made the claim I'm deluded. Come he made the claim. On. Come now, if you want to make a claim, I don't mind you making a claim. On, stop trying to be right? smart. Right? And if you want to make a claim, I'm deluded. Stop trying to be smart. Support your claim. If you stop, can't support stop, your claim, stop, 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 take your claim back. Stop, stop. Simple. Uh, stop, stop, stop. We'll, we'll, Simple, mate. We'll go back to the initial. No, we won't go back to it. Either accept I'm deluded, and if you think I'm deluded, produce your evidence to it. Otherwise, take your claim back. Am I deluded? Yes, because you believe in. All right. So you have evidence contrary to what I uh, what I, I accept I, I as said, true. Yeah. Listen. Calm down. Listen. No, no, no. We're right, mate. Muslims generally. I'm not interested in Muslims generally. I'm talking about you made a claim about me being deluded. Muslims accept. But you're not slipping it, oh, mate. Okay, talk about Allah. Do you take right. that claim? You, you take that claim? No, I understand something. Why? Every conversation I have oh. about Allah being X, Y, or Z. Oh, right? you have to fight the straw, man. Flipping wheels of gummages here now. Talk to me, mate. Why are you going about your conversation with the previous Muslims? Listen. Stay on Every point. Every conversation I speak about Allah is a counterclaim to the Muslim claim of Allah. Do you understand? Okay. Who made? No, but do you understand? Look, look, look. First, first thing, who started this conversation? You. Who came with this point? Yeah, today, you yeah, came. Yeah. To, all right, right. Yes, you, today. you made this massive point that you were going to wrap up the Muslims here in Speaker's Corner. Like, like this is not even. This is not a one thousand five hundred year conversation. You came this with the point. This conversation here today is a continuation of a one thousand. No, this conversation yeah, is me conversation. dealing we with. No, 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 no. This conversation today is dealing with you, on. Uh, the YouTube comments saying about me, I'm next, and when you see me, yes. we're gonna wrap up the Muslims yes. in Speaker's Corner. Alhamdulillah. Yes. Now we've come here, and that's the first thing. Here we go. That's here the first thing. Go. Second thing, no, no, no. Second thing, right. now you've come here, yeah. and I've asked you what the point you're making is, I'll and you, you, the point. Uh, yeah, you told me you're gonna show that me uh, accepting the idea of Allah as a creator. Oh, sorry, sorry, you're gonna show me speaking to non Muslims about uh, Allah doesn't make sense. That's what you, you said you're gonna right. prove. Right. Since then, we moved on to ancestors, and yeah. then you said you're deluded and I'm deluded. Right. Now, for me to be deluded, you need to provide evidence contrary to what I'm saying. Like, if you can, produce it. Like I said to you before. Can you produce the evidence? Like I said to you before, this my, my conversation here with you today is merely a continuation <sighs> of a 2,000 year conversation. You do understand this, right? No. Yeah, you do. No, I don't. Just like, just like you tried no, to say, I don't understand that. Just like that. you tried to say, oh, you don't, you Sarah, don't believe. 
and then you stick to you're the first no, 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 mate. Stop lying for the sake of the conversation. Sorry, mate. Stop lying for the sorry, mate. I'm sorry. What I'm dealing with you here is what I'm dealing with you here. All right, all right. Whatever conversation so anyway, you've had prior to this is none of my business. So let's wrap up then. Let's just wrap up. Wrap up. Right, let's wrap up. Oh, you don't want to wrap up. You want to keep going? Yeah. Okay, let's keep going. So, so anyway, you, why do you want to wrap up? You've proven nothing. I have proven it. No, you haven't. No, you haven't. I've you haven't. proven you wrong. Because I've proven to hang you on, on, that non-Muslims I've spoken to about Islam have understood Allah and Islam and accepted Islam. Okay. Well, so you're wrong. 170 of them. So you're wrong. 170. So you're wrong, mate. Hang on, hang on. 170. So you're wrong. Listen, listen, listen. listen. So you can't make that claim about me then, can listen, you? Listen, Just because you've spoken to 170 people that have accepted it, you could you could speak to 1,000 tomorrow that will be like, mate, that don't make no sense Well, to first me. we have to... So it doesn't matter But what we have to do first... Hang on, hang on, hang on. No, why do you think we're here? Why do you think we're here? Sarah, Sarah, Sarah. Why do you think we're here, mate? Why do you think we're here? What I'm trying to say to you. Why do you think Muslims are in speakers' corner on a Sunday? What I'm trying to say. We have to tear down your subjective beliefs. All right. What I'm trying to say to everyone here is, and the thing is, you've you've told the crowd to not get involved. Yes. But I would, like I would, like I said to the crowd, because you'll use them to slip. No, I'm not trying to slip. You will. You will. I'm trying to show things of that have a collective agreement. That's what I'm trying to show. Collectively, human beings agree. And I'll go back. We agree that nothing, we don't know of anything that has its own genetic code and produces something that is not like it. Do you accept a creator could exist? Hang Do you no, accept? That's, that's, that's Do you accept the, or not? That's not the conversation. It is. It is. That is it is. The it's the crux of the conversation. It's not. It's the crux. It's not. Because you, yes, it is. Because you don't know something. Let me continue. You don't know everything, do you, Sarah? Let me you don't know everything, do you? I told you. I'm, I'm Al Alhamdulillah. I am bound within the right. realms of what So there are I things know. you don't know, innit? Many! Right, but you Anything. know, but, but you do know, you speak to your ancestors. I wasn't going back there. Yeah, no, 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 because you're challenging... You know what's no, funny? No, no, no. What's you funny? guys seem to have more of a problem with my ancestors than I do. No, no, we have a problem oh, with your hypocrisy, else, for some reason. We have a problem and with you, your hypocrisy, mate. you don't even know them. We have a problem with your hypocrisy. You don't even know them, they've never spoken to you. We have a problem you. with your hypocrisy. That's no, the problem. No, no, it is, it is, it is. You have no consistency. Anyway, I was speaking, I was speaking. You have no consistency. But what I was speaking? Go on. Human beings here don't know of anything that does that. They believe in something that doesn't no, do that. No, no, they don't. They accept the idea. Yeah, no, no, that's that's your term. That's your term. Do you Not accept? Do you believe if without knowledge Allah about, exists, or you accept Allah exists through evidence? My friend. My friend. Through evidence, mate. My friend. Okay, so what? Hang on. Oh, he spoke. Can I use him? Who's that? This guy spoke. No. Can I use him? No. But he spoke. Yeah, we might be loose cannon. <laughs> You've got a lot of loose cannons in my Yeah, but I know you, you pick on loose cannons and You've you start making straw man arguments if with I was them. To ask this guy, right? If he knows of anything. In his realm of knowledge, of his realm of knowing anything, does he know of something that has a genetic code of itself that brings forth something not of that genetic code? What would you say? No. You, you, you don't know of anything that's like that. But we just said Allah doesn't have a genetic so code. No, you have to believe in. <laughs> hang on. It's, but genetic code is in quotation marks. What I'm trying to say is. <laughs> no, no, no. No, but listen. I told you, Allah is nothing like his creation. What? what what do you know of that? Of what? You say Allah is nothing like creation. I'm trying to understand. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ascertain I, I told you. We what? know what Allah's revealed about know. Himself. It's a belief. Okay. No, no, no. It's not a belief because it's not without knowledge. Right, we're, we're, it's not without proof. It's not without evidence. Around in circles now. No, the reason we don't go around in circles is because I have evidence for what I believe. You have no evidence for what you believe. Yet you believe I don't it. Need evidence for a belief, bro. What? I don't need evidence. No, of course for you don't. Belief. All right. If I believe, but if I, listen. If I said but right today, now, on, but right I now, you today, I believe in aliens. Why? Why do you believe? No, if I said that to you, today, you speak to your ancestors, mate. I believe mate. in aliens today, and it's a belief. Knowing is subjective. I don't have to have proof. Just something that seems true to me. No, but, I believe it. Just as my I daughter, night, just as my daughter, just as my daughter gets the idea, there's a monster under her bed from something she's seen. There's reasons why you accept what you believe. Right. Now you believe in you, you believe in your ancestors and such. Obviously, it's to do with the heritage. Because I'm pretty sure if you were a Hindu, you wouldn't believe that. Pretty sure. Um, you. I can't speak for Hindus. But, I'm not a Hindu. No, but you know what Hindus believe, isn't it? Yeah. Right. So I'm pretty sure if you were brought up in Delhi, mm. yeah, and you and you never had this idea put in your brain that you converse with dead people yeah then you wouldn't have this idea you converse with dead people but you have this idea you converse with dead people and that these dead people guide you yeah now which generation of ancestor are we referring to here are we talking ancient Egyptians or are we talking about how are the ancient Egyptians my ancestors do you not believe that I don't know that ancient is my ancestor. you don't believe that then you I don't accept that I don't that. know that you don't accept that no I don't know that do you believe it though I don't know that they were. I'm not, I, I actually you know. You did actually you know? Do you believe it? You believe you speak I, to your ancestors? I just, you, I just gave you an answer. No, you didn't. I, I said you believe you speak to. Uh, do you believe your ancestors were ancient I Egyptians? I speak to my ancestors. You do. You believe. You're I know what they look like when I speak to them. 
and I hear what they say. That's true to me. But I'm how? Saying, no, no. Are your ancient, are your ancestors ancient why Egyptians does, or not? Do you believe it? No, I, want, that, why, I want to understand I want what you believe. I want to know why that matters. Why it matters? Yeah, I want to know why that matters. Because just like my daughter believes there's a monster under her bed, I want to know why you believe you talk to dead people. That's why. As I said to you, I don't need to prove a belief. You I'm not asking to prove it. I want to know why you believe it. My belief is. I'll, I'll give you. I'll make it simple for you. Okay. You were talking about all these people who are not Muslim. How they become Muslim, right? The first thing is all these people have been brain defiled with different ideas of God and different ideas of religion. The people's fault now. Yeah, obviously. Oh, okay. The people have... You guys have been brain defiled, you know? Yeah. Not the... Here's what you've got to understand. You're yeah. brain defiled. Here's what you've got to understand, yeah. This can, no, no, no. Here's what you've got to understand. People are products of their social conditioning. <laughs> all right? Now, Christians in this country, yeah? Yeah? We're persecuted into being Christians. Yeah, Catholics persecuted, Protestants persecuted, right? In South America, the conquistadors, when they went there, yeah, they forced Christianity on the people. Now, generations later, now they're all walking with the cross on Easter and all this business, yeah? Right. Why? Because of their ancestors. Right. Just like the black slave trade in America, yeah? They were taken from the Muslim like lands. The, like the Kunta Kinte, Kunta Kinte in roots, yeah? Do you remember the Muslim slave trade? Kunta Kinte, is he a Muslim? He was a Muslim, isn't he? No, do you remember the Muslim slave trade, though? Do you remember the Arabs? Nothing to do what we're talking about. Oh, we're not talking about. about. No, we're talking about people. We're talking about, oh, well. If you're talking about how African tribes used to enslave other African tribes and sell them to Arabs, no problem. Anyway, not interested. Is that what happened? <laughs> Why is that what happened? <laughs> you don't believe that? Okay. You don't believe that? Oh, mate. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. Uh, mate, Come here, wrong. I Am I wrong? Continue. Continue. Are you saying, Continue. are you saying African tribes did not enslave other African tribes and sell them to the Arabs? Are you saying they didn't? Or are you saying, are you saying the Arabs went into Africa with Zulu warriors, yeah, and they defeated and enslaved them? What was the Zulu warriors thing? What was that? I'm talking with regards to the men, they're strong, they're powerful, they're in the jungles, it's their manner. You think Arabs from the desert are going to go and start you, you, you enslaving to, people? Watch Come on, mate. You need to watch what you're doing, you know? Yeah, you why? You need to really watch why? what you're doing. Yeah, you do. no, you need to oh, forgive me, that wasn't a racist comment. I'm oh, talking about the power oh, of the Zulus. Okay. No, no, you need to watch what you're doing. It wasn't racist. Yeah. All right. For the, for the purpose of the camera, it wasn't racist. What I was making a point is that in Africa, Africa, they're big men, yeah, strong men, yeah, yeah, yeah. hunters, yeah. For a, a week, for an Arab to wander off the desert into the jungles and start enslaving them is mind-boggling. When you look at the history of Africa, you'll see African tribes when they attacked other tribes, enslaved them, and sold them as slaves. And that's where the slave. Anyway, I don't want to digress. I don't want to digress. Anyway, the point I was making with regard to slavery is that the religion of their ancestors was removed from them, and Christianity was forced upon them. My point is this: when I said to all these people, I've been brain defiled, is the fact that what they believe. As been not there is what their social conditioning is, and what someone taught them, who taught them, who taught them, who, and at the end of the chain, forced them to believe. And it, now it's, it seems natural, yeah, but it wasn't. Ireland used to be Unitarian Christians, never Catholics, Unitarians, yeah? England was pagan until Charlemagne, yeah? What's a, what's a pagan? Worshipping um, idols and such. So, until Charlemagne came to England and forced Christianity on England, mm. yeah, it wasn't a natural thing to be Christian, but today, it's a Christian country, apparently, yeah? So what I'm saying to you is this, until you break down the parameters of what people's subjective beliefs are and challenge them, so I'm challenging your ancestor, for example, because if you come to the idea, why do I believe that I talk to dead people? Why, why is it? What have, I, what have I read that told me this? Who told me I'm speaking to dead people, my ancestors who are guiding me? How can I trust their guidance? How do I know they were on good guidance, yeah? Until you challenge that, you'll never come to Islam. You'll never come to anything else. Okay. So you got to tear down those let walls me, um, first. Let me, let me, let's, let's see if let, let's see if my African or many African ancestors were on good guidance. Let's just let's just look at the basics. African. Let's establish first. You're speaking to them. Hang on. A ancient African societies had they they um, they revered the water, air. Many of them, sun, moon, um, trees, animal life. Okay. First, that, no, no, I, I have to say something. Have to, you rolled for no, no, about I have to three say, minutes. No, no, I have to say one thing. You, no, no, no. No, no, no. I have to make a point. I have to make a point. Let me tell you. You can roll. You can roll. It's not going to challenge it. I'm not going to challenge it. I'm just going to make a point. Let me roll. No, I'm going to make a point. Let me roll. Let me roll. Let me roll. Let me roll. These people had deities, or they deified these things, almost like God. Almost like God. Not, not actually like God. Today, Western society, Muslim society, mess up your water supply. They mess up your air supply. What? They mess up. They mess up your. Um, hang on. They mess up your air supply. They mess up the animal life. They mess up the plant life. Maybe, just maybe, if you guys, if you guys, had more of an inkling as, as to the nature in which gives you life, you wouldn't be messing it up. So I would say my ancestors were smarter than you guys. 
Alhamdulillah. Because now, you guys are living in some really messed up world where the trees are being chopped down and the water's being polluted and the air's being messed up. That's what you guys are living in. Oh, that's what we're all living in. Whereas these people who weren't doing it, you called them primitive and pagan. Okay, first thing. I'm just saying. Okay, first thing. Those people I was smarter than you. Okay. But first, you had Allah. Okay. And you had Jesus. First and thing. You had Yahweh. But okay. the whole planet's being destroyed. Okay. First but you got God though. Okay. First whereas thing. These, no, 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 no. But whereas these people knew the All divinity right. of nature. Uh, right. They so, knew the divinity that they were living in because they were part of it right. and never separated right. themselves. Let's take that words off Gamage now. Okay. Let's take that words off. So we know how to live in harmony let, let, with the planet. Forget your logical fallacies, that, mate. Hang on. Forget so your logical fallacies, mate. Harmony with the planet All right. That we inhabit. All right. Okay. Okay. You don't. All right. Alhamdulillah. Okay. You got Allah though. Okay. Let's deal with your. You got Allah though. Okay. Let's deal with your logical fallacy of the straw man once more. Okay. I never once said African ancient people were primitive. Yeah. I personally love. But you would say they're pagan, though, right? I didn't say that. No, but you would do. I didn't know. No, you didn't. No. Would you? I don't know. Don't know them. Right. I personally, when I've read the the 42 uh, tenants um, of the on the. Um, of the, the yeah. Of the Nile Valley, yeah. Basically, I, I, I think they're fantastic. Of Ma'at, yes. The 42 tenants of Ma'at are fantastic. Mm. Yeah. I have no problem with that. For me, that's Islam. I love it. Yeah. I have no problem with it. That's why I was asking you. They never called it Islam, though. Funnily enough, you would say it's Islam, so? but they never called it Islam. So. It's not got to do with anything. I love the tenets of it. Sure. So if you follow those tenets, I'm, uh, I, I, I'll roll with that. I think it's fantastic. If, if you're on that, yeah. Right. Now let me ask you: What do your answers to say with regards to racism, and and thinking that one what race is superior to another? Ancestors. Yeah, because you take guidance from your ancestors, isn't it? Your your ancestors guide you. No, not in everything. No. Oh, they don't guide you. I guide myself in a lot of things. So what do they guide you in, and what don't they guide you in? Matter? I'm not going to tell you what they guide me. Because your worldview is being informed of this subjective That's belief, right. Right. right? And it's poisoned me. You, it's poisoned me. Say so. Well, do you believe in racism? Do you believe one man is superior over another I man due to the colour of his skin? Do you? Do you believe in the you know idea? What is? Okay. Yes, one race thinks it's superior over another race. All right, let's let's look at that. Definitely. Alhamdulillah. Let's see. That. Do you believe that? Let's see that. Definitely. Do you believe that though? And then let's ask a question. Okay. Let's, well, ask, uh, 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 fact, a let's ask a let's ask a question. Go on. Who defined racism? Me. Do you believe? Hang on. What's racism question? defined by people who never actually experienced? I'm asking you. Do you believe one race is superior over another race due to you. their heritage or color of skin? Yes I'm or no? You. Do you believe that? Did a people? Did a believe people? Do a people? Did a people that have never experienced racism? Do people believe that have never experienced it? What? Define racism. I'm asking you. This is no. you. What well, you believe? This is what's happened, though. So what you believe? No, a people who have never experienced racism. Bro, I'm dealing with your defined. subjective beliefs, mate. I'm dealing that's with your what, no, subjective what, beliefs. What, what I'm not speaking to everybody else. Here. I'm speaking to you, mate. And I want to know about you and your subjective beliefs and your guidance from your ancestors. Do you believe one person or one race is superior over another race due to color of skin or heritage? Now, let, now, let, yes. or not? Let's look at let's look at the actual definition of racism, right? As defined by a psychologist, psychiatrist. What? Just define it by the dictionary. Oh no, 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 we can't define it by a dictionary, bro. <laughs> Because a dictionary is the dictionary hang, on, hang on, hang no, on. But let me ask you a question. I take back the word racism. No, but let me. I take it back. I take it back. But let me ask you. A I take it back. I take it back. No, no, he's no. Asked, he's no, no, don't, no, no, don't, don't ask, ask questions. questions. Don't no, ask he questions. Good question. He said. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> what I'm trying to say. I told you don't let the guy slip. God, yeah, you are. Who, who can I speak to with other than Hamza? I'm alright. I'll ask you. Did you put your hand up? You just scratching your head. I'll ask you. I'll ask you. If a, if a family of people had been raped for 50 years consistently, <sighs> I'm asking you, Go on. 50 years consistently, and then the rapists of that family chose to define rape, would that be fair? You didn't ask the people who were actually raped for 50, 50 years, would you ask the people who are the rapists to define rape, or the people who are the actual victims of rape? Okay. Who would you ask? Okay. Who would have a better oh, understanding okay. of what rape actually was? Okay, just to break down this paradigm, yeah? I'm asking. I've talked about the word racism, mate. I've took it back. No, no, but I'm no, no, I was wrong. I apologise. I've, I've took it back. I've took it back. I'm I apologise. No, I took it back. I'm, okay, fine, you took it back, fine. I took it back. I'll take it. No, I'm asking you the question. No, I'm asking you a question. Do, so, your who question. Would, okay, okay. Who would better understand what rape was? The rape victim who's been consistently raped, or the rapist, or is it, or is it good to understand both sides of what one person thinks is rape and what the other person thinks is rape? What do you think? Well, who defines what rape is? The rapist, according to you. No, I didn't. The people. I didn't say that. Hang on. The people. No, who, I didn't. Hang on. Don't build no straw man. Hang on. Hang on. Throw those red herrings back in the river. It's metaphorical. It's metaphorical. Yeah, well, stop your logical fallacies, mate. You want to start logic? Speak logic. Let stop me, bringing logical fallacies speak, in. Let me speak. All right. Oxford Dictionary was written, or the def definition of racism in the Oxford Dictionary was written by who? White people, yeah? Would, would we say Aborigines wrote it? Nah. Would we say Africans wrote it? Nah. We would say a people that have never actually experienced racism thought 
they could Who defines what white people? Was? What do you mean white people? So shall we read? So, so let's read what the actual definition. No, I took it back. I took it back. Oh, so you don't want to, do you don't no. want to know it? No. Oh, okay. Right. Let me ask you the question again. Do you believe one race of people is superior over another race of people no. due to the in regards to their uh, skin I, color or heritage? What I know is. Black African people are the mothers and fathers of every right. people here. Right. That's what I know. Right. So do you believe So is your mother superior to you? Do you believe black people black are superior to white people? No, I believe no, no, I know that black people are superior. Are the are the mothers and fathers or the blueprint of humanity. Do you believe black people That's are superior? I no, I t told you what I know. No, you didn't. I'm do you, not talking about beliefs. Do you accept? Do you accept that black people are superior to I white people? No, I'm I don't accept that. Do you accept that? I'm not talking about no beliefs. No, I didn't say belief. I said accept. Do you accept that black people are superior to white people? Acceptance is your word. Yeah. You Do you accept it? Accept. I'm talking about knowings and beliefs. So you know black people. I know right, black right. people gave birth to every. So you every say it. All right. So you know. I know that. You know, or know you that. think, based on whatever you've read, that black people are superior to white people. Did That's I, what you're saying. Did I say that? Yes. That's exactly what you said. I said that. Yes. When? You said because black people are the mothers of white people, therefore you're not better than your mother. So obviously your mother's better than you. That's what you said. And I just entangled it and Hang did on, it. What, when? Why? Can you just answer anyone? the question? Anyone? Anyone? Shall I repeat the question? Shall I repeat the question? Yeah, I'll repeat the question. Okay. okay. It's a very clear yeah, question. I'll make it easy for you. I'm going to show you. No. Come out. I'm going to ask Kamal. One second. I'm going to ask Kamal. Come out. Oh, you might actually say yes. Do you believe? Black people are superior oh, to so white we, people. Oh, so you can use people around the camera now? Yeah. Okay, well, I believe. Black people are superior to white people. No. Do you believe black people are superior to white people? Do you believe black people are superior to white people? Do you believe black people are superior to white people? I don't do with beliefs. I do with knowing. Uh, answer the question. Uh, answer the question. Do you think do black people are... Uh, you, you hit me on the word, Billy. You. <laughs> You're going to abstain from the answering I now. Told you. Do you accept black people are superior to white people? Do I accept? Black, black people are superior to white people. In what sense? That they're, they're superior. In what sense? In every sense. This conversation's gone everywhere sense? today, boy. Just that's what that was the point, wasn't it? Everywhere. Just overall, no. No. Knowledge, no. Sorry, say again. In knowledge. In knowledge. We were the first with knowledge. It depends on what you're saying. Oh, okay, so. Uh, it depends uh, on what you're saying. If you're saying I, I knew I was asking you that question was wrong. Yeah, no, no. Because you believe what he believes. If, if, oh. Who believes? Okay, so you do believe that. Okay. Alright, uh, so do you accept black people are superior to white people? I know that, far to, that black people are the mothers and Can you just answer the question? Oh, the planet! Can you just answer the question? Now. Can you just answer the question? Now? Now. So are my ancestors black? Yes, they are. Thank you. I'm sorry to say, but they were, yeah. yeah okay, why are you sorry to say that? Because <laughs> you, you are... You why are you sorry to say you that? Are a, you are a poor excuse. Why are you sorry to say that? A poor excuse for a child, bro. Why is that? I'm just telling why you that? a poor excuse for I don't a child. teach my children racism. I don't teach my children that they're superior bro, to someone else's color of skin. No, I don't racism teach it. Racism is taught as soon as you step out the black oh, front door. You don't have to teach uh, it. Well, this is a beautiful thing, you see, because my way of life is Islam, and Islam doesn't allow racism yeah, either. Right. Yeah, all right. Right. yeah, that's right. If you yeah. say so, basically, my guidance... Just like your guidance. Yeah, that's like that. That's it. No, he doesn't. That's okay. Not what was? No, 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 no. Okay. Oh. For the purpose of the camera oh, okay. again. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I'm gonna do it. No, it doesn't teach racism. That was right? to but show. The, oh, oh, everybody's seen Zulu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone's seen you know the power. Why? Do you know why? Everyone's seen you know the power why? of the Africans. Yeah. I tell you. I tell Everyone's you seen the power of the Africans. Yeah. And you, you cannot you. enslave those boys. You I can't just go and enslave them, bro. I tell you. They're tribes. They're organized. They've got the trees. They know the score. Yeah. I tell you. Arabs off the desert can't just walk there and start tying people up. I tell you why. It's impossible. Because you don't even understand that racism is a sub conscious conversation that's going on in everyone's brain right now bro you don't even understand i think it's a conscious i think it's no, conscious me yeah. i think it's on the table mate and, 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 and we're like oh no 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 it wasn't actually racist okay when i said ooh, ooh i'm talking with the flipping spear mate already going on bro if anything exactly on, yeah man. exactly i'm saying how listen to it listen Come to this on, yeah bro. don't listen to this how did weak weak listen to the word weak arabs trundling off the desert going to africa and take on these strong african warriors impossible mate Impossible! Exactly! The Arabs are a beef with me, mate! <laughs> people generally. Oh my God. People generally have no idea about. You have no idea about. You have no idea about. <laughs> Neanderthal gene, aggression, axiology. Islam prohibits racism, mate. Yeah. Prohibits it, mate. Yeah. But it just had to happen. So if you want, if you want racism out of your life, Muslims follow Islam. Because racism is eradicated. 
No, Islam doesn't permit is racism. Prohibits racism. But it just so happens so just that many Muslims sorry, sorry, are racist. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, exactly. It just second, so before we continue, happens. let's just clarify what he said, yeah? He said, he said, Arabs, no, can you hold on, mate? Arabs wouldn't be able to go in and defeat yes, they would. the African... No, no, that's I'm telling you what he said. He said Arabs would not be able to go into the jungle or anywhere and to, into Africa and defeat that... Zulu African nation, warrior. no chance. That puts Arabs down. He's not putting no Africans chance. down. He's saying that, Africans are strong. Is that not what you said? Exactly what I said, mate. If you want to twist... But these guys have an agenda. Bro, I want to hear the logical bro, answers bro, here. Bro, 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 if we can bring bro, bro. the logical debate... I'll tell, tell, tell you something. Get back to that question. I'll tell you something. Get back to the whatever right, You defend him. Defend him. Defend your master. Defend your master. I'm asking you, mate. Defend your master. Defend your master. Is that racism? Huh? Is that racism? Is what racism? Is that racism? Why do you think I'm his master? Defend your master. Why do you think I'm his master? What sense, bro? It's my belief. Say some what? I ain't gonna prove it, bro. Right, so you are racist. my belief. So you think because I'm white, I'm superior? Did I say that? Yes. You implied it. People can get all kind of things from conversations. They can sound oh, so like you, so you say things for no reason. And not imply something. Yeah, right. That's what you all got right. from it. So I think we can all know you're a racist, mate. That's, uh, we're happy with that. No, we we'll take that. No, we didn't get to the we, we we'll didn't get that. to the definition of racism, though, did we? Oh my, I didn't say racism. But you call me a racist. But you don't want to get to the definition of it. Oh, let's, let's see. I tell you, you get to the definition. Uh, I'll get okay. to the definition of it. You get your definition. I will get my definition. Yeah. Yeah. You get. And let's see who's matches the definition and yours. Who's yeah, made up? You, yeah. You get your definition. All right. Are you going to get your definition of a white man or a black man? A, a, a black woman, actually. Oh, okay. A black woman. I thought so. <laughs> Why? Is, is that a problem? She's a psychologist and psychiatrist and has studied racism. Is that a problem? Well, I think uh, I think the dictionary is uh, pretty independent. Of course mate. you would. Why? Oh, sorry. Of course you would. Using the dictionary to define words. Of course yeah, you would. yeah, obviously. Especially the word that you don't have any idea about. Of course you would. Really? Just like the rapist and the victim. Okay. Racist, noun. A person who believes that a particular race is superior to another. Fair enough. You just proved that I'm superior to him because I'm white. So you believe that? Is that what I said? So That's what you implied. Can we read my definition now? So he's my master. Let's read my definition. Why am master? Okay. Having you or showing the belief that a particular race is superior yeah. to another. Yeah, that's very simple, isn't it? Very that's, simple. That, do you know what that is? Noun adjective. That is classic. I'll tell you what it is. That's classic um, European uh, food. What? No seasoning. What, dic what seasoning. dictionary? Let's get oh, all right, so That's you're ignoring the dictionary. Real. No seasoning. Oh, okay, very, okay. Very simple. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No seasoning. Let's get to the seasoning. No, yeah, yeah. Right? Let's, yeah. Get, let's don't, see what the Don't forget to put the chicken about. there, mate. Don't yeah. forget the chicken, yeah. mate. Yeah. Let, let's you're ignoring the let's chicken, mate. The put your seasoning on right? your chicken, mate. We're going to put the seasoning on, marinate the thing, put some garlic on there, some onions. Let's get to see what racism actually is, right? According to a black woman, yeah? According to a psychiatrist and psychologist, black black woman, yeah. Her name is Frances Cress Wilson. Is this what's not my dad's bigger than your dad? I'll get a someone country. Are we, are we gonna get Shall I go to a BNP site and talk about the whites definition? being superior? One second, let me, let me, one second, one second. Let me go to the KKK. I'll Google that. Is, is the local <laughs> global power system and dynamic structured and maintained by persons who classify themselves as white? Whether consciously or subconsciously determined, which also consists of perception, logic, symbol formation, thought, speech, action, emotional response, as conducted simultaneously in areas of activity, economics, education, entertainment, labor, law, politics, religion, and war, for the ultimate purpose of white genetic survival. <laughs> white genetic survival, oh my yeah. god. <laughs> to prevent white genetic annihilation <laughs> this, on the This lady's paranoid, mate. Really? Yeah, she sounds paranoid, mate. Yeah, all right. The white people are taking Listen, over. Let me tell you something. There's a, there, I, 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 I'm, if we go off topic. It's funny though, the, the, let's go the BNP thing, the brown ahead. people are taking no, over. Let's, let's, go, let's go off topic for a second. Sure. You, everyone here knows, everyone of color knows that soon, as for white people, as soon as a brown person, a yellow person, a black person steps within their their vicinity, they're like, whoa, what's going on? Well, everybody these, knows these that. These people are going to take over. You need to go, people, to, oh my God, you need to go to a mosque, mate. Many of those you need to go to a mosque, mate. Take over. Oh, well, no, we're, we're not paranoid, bro. We know you, bro. Like we've been you studying you, know who? you for you know a very long you know time. Who? We've been you know studying who? you for a very long you know time. You know who? So let's continue. Let's continue. Let's continue. What are you talking about? A planet upon which the vast majority of people are classified themselves. So as classified as non-white, black, brown, red, and yellow by white people. And the non-white people are genetically sorry, and the non-white people are genetically dominant in terms of skin and skin coloration compared with the genetic recessive white skin people. Hang on. The system of racism, white supremacy, uses deceit, violence, um, biological warfare, chemical warfare, and by any means necessary to achieve its ultimate goal of white genetic survival to prevent to prevent white genetic annihilation. 
God. That's racism. Oh that, is, that is where racism comes from. No, no. You have to ask the why. I'll tell you something about racism. No one asks the why. Everyone talks about racism. No one asks why yeah. would a group what? of people okay, one right. day, why, why right. would you wake up and say, you know what? I am going to subjugate these people purely based on their race. I'm gonna, hang on. I'm going to ask why. Why, why would why. they do I'm that? Gonna ask why. The reason why. Why do you think I'm his master? Hang on. Why do you think no, I'm no, his no, master? No, no, I'm not finished. I'm not finished. All right. The reason why is because you know when you come into contact with these people, the, the people on the planet who have dominant genes over the white genes. I'm a Gary. Right? Hang on. To be Bro, a bright man. Listen. To be a bright man. Yeah, this is all right, right, all right, mate. All right, mate. All right, mate. All right, mate. This is what it's reduced to, mate. It's like you know when you boil milk. This you, is what it's reduced to. <laughs> it's frothing over now. It's all right. Gone. You, you, listen. You can go. Sorry, I don't want to stop you. Gone. It's fine. Now we know. I don't know. I don't know. This is proving know, your point initially. We but anyway. know as people of color that we could genetically point. annihilate white people tomorrow. <laughs> if if every person of color had sex with a white woman tomorrow, the white race is finished. Finished. Done. Over. Done. Right? Which is why, which is why, right? In, when they came into contact with black skinned people or dark people, they had a thing about the black penis. White people seem to be obsessed with the black penis for some reason. I don't know why. I've been in conversations with white guys and they, and they, they want to run a penis joke. I don't know why my penis would be the topic of people's conversation, but, I'm not but, it, your seems penis, like it, but it seems like it is. You're a black man, right? Have you, has any, any white person ever commented on this penis size or something as a black man? Yeah, he's smiling because he knows. <laughs> Every black man's had it. We don't understand the white people's like, obs obsession with the black penis. Even during, um, even during bloody um, lynchings, the first thing they would castrate off the, or take off the person they lynched was the penis. And would parade it around like, yeah, we got the penis, we got the penis. When the black people went into Arabia and they were taking the slaves, castrate the slaves. Who castrated? Some, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. For the, the black penis, who castrated like the guys, slaves? What, who, guys, who did the castration? Because you guys know that's where the power lies. Who did the castration? Who did the castration? Who did the castration? Come on, man, you studied this. Sarah, Sarah, one second, one second. You studied this. Who did the castration? No Muslim Arabs. Who told you that? No show, me, show me that. Show me your history. Uh, from what I've read in history, it, the Africans knew the Arabs preferred eunuchs, so they would castrate the slaves, knowing the Arabs would more likely buy those slaves over their other slaves. From what I know, I don't know. I've never seen anywhere where uh, I'm, I'm just going to point to this website so you can go on. Where Arabs take a black slave from Africa and then castrate him. I've never ever heard that. I'll just give you this website. So yeah, okay. Anyway, I don't know how we got to penises. I know. Giza came here. No, because Giza came here, called me out to prove that me speaking well, we to non-Muslim, we didn't prove nothing. There you go. We didn't prove nothing. There you go, arabslavetrade.com. Go for it. You, 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 you. I'll give you an alternative to that, yeah? Right, cool. Okay. Are we finished we'll, we'll, we'll swap exchanges. Are we finished now? Well, we're going to see if you prove your point or not. We finished. So, the point you were making here, apparently... You've been dying for a while now. Well, alhamdulillah. Well, we needed to, didn't we? We needed to get all this out. Hour and a half. Yeah. All right. So, and we know now, I don't think there's anything else to say to each other, to be honest. We could have gone to energy. I mean, I'm happy to go there as well. I know you did it with Ali. Bro, I'm happy to go, go there. We've been there for an hour and a half. All right. We'll continue next time, no problem. Yeah, next time. Three weeks, yeah? Energy. Yeah, if you want, that's yeah? fine. That's all right. Cool. Cosmology, all right. We'll leave it at that then. Absolutely cool. But anyway, let's go back to the original point here. Mm. You came here, called me out, challenged me on YouTube that you're going to come here, you're going to wrap up the Muslims in Speaker's Corner. They'll never speak about Islam again after I've dealt with Hamza. I never, I never said well, I'm paraphrasing. Yeah, there's a quite a few comments. Well, quote my words, in it? Don't paraphrase. Shall I, shall I read, shall read your words? Yeah, go for it. All right, all right. But don't like. Make all right, all right, all right. All right. It's for, you know what? I apologize for that. I'll, I'll read your words. What was it? Uh, Sarah, I'm going to wrap. You up. That's Sarah the exposed. Let's uh, say what he said. Ha 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 Hamza is next. I think that was the exact words. We did wrap us up. I did wrap you up. You wrapped nothing up. I wrapped you up, bro. All you ended up doing was talking about I penises, mate. Nice I mean, talking about straw men, I had the flipping neck. I'm I don't know how you got to you. penises, man. I, I was told you slip conversations, but bro, you went out there, mate. <laughs> you, the point we were talking about, you were gonna prove to me about how me talking to non-Muslims about Allah makes no sense to them. Yes. And you ended up telling me how white people talk about black penises. I just don't get it, mate. I really don't. Hang on, how far into the conversation? I don't get it, mate. I don't know how you got to that. I really don't, mate. How far in the conversation did that happen? Oh, bro. And, and why did that happen? I, I think, I don't know how it happened, bro, mate. On, I don't know how it happened, mate. I don't know how it happened, mate. That's how that came if, you come through, if you come with a let's, point, let's, let's not be stick to the point. Let's not, let's not Prove silly. the point. Do you know how many points we came through today? Do you know how many points we actually touched on today? Racism was a lot. I think you were refuted on every point, mate. I think you refuted on every point. Anyway. That place 
to that place with no kind of, you know, in between. No, but your original point hasn't been proven. No, it has been proven. How was it proven? Because I'm, te because, I, oh my God, I'm going to go back again. Um, because... What was your original point? Hang on, because we don't know of anything that does that. That wasn't your point? Yes, it was. We don't know of anything you that said its own, its own genetic no, no, no. code, its own you thing. You said, that's what we said. I'm telling right, you how on, I proved on, it. On, we don't know of anything that has its own genetic code and then produces something not of its genetic code. Okay. We don't know of anything like that. Okay, we believe in things like that. What was my response to that? We don't know of What was my response like to that? Ah, it's nonsense. What was my response? You have to repeat yourself. Okay. I'm, 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 it's a very, very simple response. Oh, <laughs> okay. First thing, yeah, you said the me talking to people, non-Muslims, about Islam, yeah, don't understand what I mean when I speak about Allah, yeah? When, and I, when I speak with, about Allah. With those parameters. Right. Now, the logical, logic, lo okay, okay, you know the logical fallacy. With those parameters. You know the logical fallacy. Evidence of absence and absence, absence of evidence is not evidence of absence, yes? Okay. So just because you don't know something, so first of all, so just because you don't know something right. for surety right. doesn't mean that something doesn't exist. But you're believing it. No, 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 no. But there's a difference. No, it's not. There's a, you're no, believing it. No, it's not. No, it's not. There's a reason why I'm accepting it. Yeah? Oh, oh, oh I forgot the word Alhamdulillah. Accepting. Oh, yeah, the word accept. You're the belief. You're, the, 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 word one word believe. Believe. you're the one believing without, you're the one believing. You're the one believing without knowledge, mate. Oh. I'm, I'm accepting what I believe with intellectual investigation. That's the difference between me and thee. If you say so. 100% mate, yeah? Say so, so basically, you're trying to say that when I speak about Allah to non-Muslims, I make no sense. Yeah? You, because you don't you, know of anything that exists no, but do you. without a cause. But even, no. Yes, no, no, yes, no, no, yes, yes. Because let's use no, your, let's use argument. your, it's the same argument, that mate. Wasn't the it's argument. the same no, argument, no, mate. No, 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 no. no? I'm not gonna lie really? To, I'm not going to allow you to just put words in my really? mouth like that. I'm not going to allow that. Okay, you're Come saying on. to me, because you don't know. I'm not going to allow that. Come on. All right, all right, all right. I'm smarter than this. Don't do that. Because you said. You may try to do that. One second, one second, one second. You said. Now listen. One second. No, no, no. You said, because you don't know of something that can exist by itself, so self sustain and such, yeah? That means that thing doesn't exist. No, you, that's not what I said either. What did you say? Because you weren't listening. What? Could you, that's why you're asking me. You said, do we know of anything that can create something out not on its genetic code? Yes? That's that, what you said. Yeah. Do Alhamdulillah. We, do we know anything no. that can, exactly. Right. Can something exist okay, okay, that's that doesn't it. No. need it? Is the answer. But you don't know no. that. You don't know that. No, you said you no. You can't know that. You said no. No, no. But you, I said. No, did you just say no? I said no. What we. <laughs> no, no, no. You said <laughs> right, something that exists, like for example, a monkey having chairs is ridiculous. Right. It's, it's ridiculous, right? That is. Absolutely. Okay, alhamdulillah. But the idea. And, so, and something else creating something that's not of like it. No, no, but because of cosmology and because of science and because of Albert Einstein and all of these great scientists, white scientists, I must add, that you take, like to take from, um, Stephen Hawkins, I think you've quoted in the past as well. I think that was Gary. No. So don't worry. Oh, is it? Oh, sorry. Yeah. Forgive me. Sorry. You're both on the same tip, though. Yeah, I know you both hate yeah, that I know idea. All the, all <laughs> I know you both hate that idea. I know you don't want the white man all, telling all, you what's what. All us black guys look alike, right? You don't need the white yeah, man yeah, telling yeah. you what's all, what. All I know you don't like the white man telling you what's what. But anyway, anyway, anyway. If one black guy says so, anyway, so that indicates an initial cause, and because it indicates an initial cause, that cause has to be independent of anything. So it doesn't have a genetic code from anything else. Has to be something completely abstract from what we have, and we know Allah says He is exactly that. So it's simple, mate. Is that a belief or a knowing, bro? It's an acceptance due to the evidence, mate. <laughs> Alright, let's forget Sarah? this. Let's forget this, bro. Let's it's been a pleasure, it. bro. Yeah, oh, seriously, it. seriously. Give us that Seriously. <laughs> And I apologise, the Zulu thing wasn't intended to be yeah, anywhere. Of course, of course it was. Of course it Listen, listen, just understand one thing, that yeah? Was your subconscious, that was your subconscious going, mate. I know, but understand one thing, understand one thing, please. As a Muslim, in front of you right I can't now, have a racist bone in my body, mate. No, no, I'm not saying that. No, 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 wait. It might have come across a bit below the belt. It wasn't intended in that manner. Forgive me, guys, yeah? Cheers, guys. Okay. Can I, can I talk to the camera now? Go for it. Oh, okay. So Sarah came to prove a point today, didn't prove that point. No. Oh, is, this, is this what you're going to do? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to assassinate you now, mate. Okay. Sarah, is that you? Go ahead. Oh my god, that's what You can talk to your camera, mate. No worries. No, I don't do that. I don't need to do well, that. Well, I do, I, I do need to. I'll tell you why. Allow the people to think it's, it's what you call a conclusion, mate. Allow the people to you have to conclude, mate. Tell them what happened. It's a, it's a conclusion, mate. 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 You tell them to think for themselves. It's a conclusion. What can we? What can? All right, I'll take. So what happened today? Sarah yeah, yeah, called me out on YouTube. If you want me to read the, the the things, I will do. Because he said, "Don't put words in my mouth." So I need to um, quote from the horse's mouth. Okay. Sarah's words. The fact that you had to post a video with the cat.
caption, true colours exposed, and nothing was exposed shows you guys are reaching. Laughing face. When I debate Hamza, it's a wrap for you Muslims at Speaker's Corner. I don't want to hear any crying or bitching. I show Shabir was a liar, Hussein self-destructed, and when Hamza stands in front of me, it's going to be case closed for you egotistical and arrogant Muslims. <laughs> you get a two-week countdown before light. I light the fire. <laughs> So that was the challenge. So I came here today and I made sure when we started, we knew what we were talking about because he has a bit of smoke and mirrors. And uh, his point to prove was what? That when I speak to Muslim, non-Muslims about Allah, I make no sense to them. Which doesn't make no sense because I do speak to non-Muslims and they do accept Islam. So I don't know what his point was. And then we rolled through everything. Inshallah, this is only part one. Part two is coming. Energy. Get ready.